This is uh, what's been happening as far as the state of Punjab is concerned. Political turmoil with respect to the ruling party, the Congress here, and the infighting that continues. Congress MP Rahul Gandhi has met with the Punjab Congress leaders. This includes uh, the state Congress president, Sunil Jakar, Manpreet Badal, as well as MP Pratap Singh Bajwa. Now, Bajwa, after meeting Rahul Gandhi, has said that they discussed the political situation there in Punjab. But it's also important to note here that this development here comes in... Uh, just about a day after the Chief Minister, Captain Amrinder Singh, had met with three members of the Congress panel. This was a panel that was set up to end factionalism that was being reported in the party. It is also being learned here that uh, the ongoing rift, uh, this is something that is, of course, spearheading the factionalism here, the ongoing rift between Sidhu and also ways to strengthen the party in Punjab ahead of next year's assembly polls as Punjab is headed for 2022 state assembly elections there. We have with us our correspondent Gurpreet, who's getting us further updates here on this. Uh, uh, Gurpreet, on the rumblings that we've heard from within the Congress uh, in Punjab here, uh, meetings now that continue with the top leadership in the centre. Well, yes, of course, that uh, we have seen that uh, for the last so many days, infighting is continuing within the Congress, and especially that uh, the Joe Singh Sidhu versus Captain Amrinder Singh is, uh, was going on. And uh, we have seen that today that uh, Punjab Affairs in charge, Harish Rawat, he has uh, openly speaking that 18-point uh, agenda has been given to the Chief Minister of Punjab, Captain Amrinder Singh, to implement with a proper deadline. At the same time, we have seen that uh, all the other Congress leaders, whether it's of Nas, Mr. Manpreet Singh Badal or Pratap Singh Bajwa and Sunil Jakar, they have been called by the party high command to understand what was the reason behind this infighting. And we have seen that uh, there was the two, three reasons for the infighting. One was very clear that uh, sacrileges are, uh, cases are not properly investigated by the Congress government. And a lot of MLAs and ministers, they had come up with this issue. They had approached the party high command on this issue. And finally, the first meeting a few months, a uh, few uh, days back, that meeting had been called by uh, the three-member committee, which had been set up by the by the Congress President Sonia Gandhi, that had called each and every MLA to understand the basic problems. And these were the three issues. And today, uh, the in charge of Punjab Affairs, Harish Rawat, has mm -hmm. made it very clear that 18-point agenda has been given to the Chief Minister of Punjab, Captain Amrinder Singh, to implement. At the same time, what we have learned from the sources also that they are trying to revamp the structure within the state because uh, mission 2022 is going on in the mind of Congress. At the same time, they are trying to uh, start image building, uh, building in the state because that is also uh, very important for the Congress at this point of time. So we can see that uh, now Jakar has come out uh, against, against the decision of uh, the Punjab Chief Minister on the jobs which had been given to the uh, Congress MLA's son. So all these, uh, all these things are going to be uh, held here and that's why the High Command has already been intervened and now it's yet to be seen whether they will be able to pacify both our camps because uh, basically three camps have come up in Punjab. One is Navjot Singh Sidhu's camp, another is Captain Amrinder Singh's camp and third camp is Pratap Singh Bajwa's camp. So all these camps are in fighting with each other to get okay. supremacy from the party and that's why our three member committee has already been intervene intervened to pacify all the three camps so that they will be able to put a united front mm -hmm. in the upcoming election 2022 and they will right. be able to contest the election as okay. a united front of Congress because a lot of infighting will damage the party right. and the way a uh, lot of questions are being raised over the governance of Absolutely. Chief yeah. Minister uh, of Three Cap factions, uh, as Chief you Minister mentioned, on infighting that has continued, a lot of this uh, that has now been taken into account by the central leadership. That's right. Gurpreet, many thanks for getting us uh, all of those related updates here. Let's now take a listen into a remark on this that is coming from the Congress MP Pratap Singh. This is a party high command. What do you do? Who do you take? Who do you take? This is a party high command. The church is my church. It's not a ground reality. I asked them to ask 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 them या एमपीज दे जेड़े ग्रीवेंसेज ने किन्हें की जवान ने जनवन ने या की है वो सारी गल बकायदा थ्रेड बेर राहुल जी ने मैडिस